sunshine. I am up at the ungodly hour of 7 a.m. in the morning. Not a morning person. Good on Yuen. Today is my orientation for business though. I reckon I'll be fine. I'm mostly scared that I'm gonna get lost. Cause like that's something I'm really good at doing. So this is the look. What's in my pencil case? Got a pen, got more pens, but this time they're colorful because life is not black and white. I have some tissue. I also had pencils, but I don't know where they went. And then I also have a notebook. This is my business book because it's, you know, black and it's very stern and, you know, business attack. Well, it, it's very business tactic. Just in case, you know, you can only be underprepared, you can never be overprepared. I don't know if I left like when I was meant to, if I left earlier or whatever, because it said it ended at like one, but I left at like 10 past 12. I got like lost at the beginning and went to this helper and she was like, what, like class? And I was like, I don't know. So there was that whole thing. So I had to go into the app, go into my emails. I was like literally traumatized. I was like, this is so scary. But yeah, it was chill. I came in a few minutes late, but some people came in like an hour late. Oh, apparently I need to like buy textbooks or something. This student asked the question like, are the book lists already out? And this guy like turns in front of the class. He's not the like, he wasn't a lecturer. He was just an nice student. He was like, yeah, good to know. And then in my head, I'm like, <laughs> I checked it four weeks ago when it said that it wasn't any readings I needed to do or any books I needed to get. So I was like, okay. Sounds good. I need to check again. That's it for uni for today. And then tomorrow it starts at 11. Thank fuck I don't have to get out of bed until fucking nine. Love lives me. I really need to drink. I was sitting in that lecture hall and oh my God. Oh my God. It was going on for ages. The like person there just kept on talking and I was like, mm. I needed a drink and my stomach started growling and I was like sorry I didn't have time for breakfast this morning and I felt like excited though like the vibes were there it was like oh new place learning whatever I was like oh yay and now I get to spend the rest of my day at home doing what I love to do which is nothing oh, sweet oh. how do I on oh there I never know how to unlock this door. Thank God it's over. I'm just heading into the shower to grab some shampoo because I have lots of product in my hair and I've got a bleaching appointment. So, you know, gotta wash it all out, babes. Um, I've got the same. I want to go maybe a bit lighter. Like I'm loving how much of it is blonde. If I go full blonde, it'll be platinum blonde. Like, Chris Olsen, that was your doing. It, Chris Olsen, if you are watching this, I loved your platinum look and it inspired me. Okay, it feels and looks beautiful, absolutely healthy. Let me just quickly dry this as fast as I can. And Looking so good for tomorrow's orientation. Outfit of the day. I don't know, it's cute. I think it's an okay outfit. And I'm blonder than I was yesterday. In love, literally in love. Today I'm hoping we'll go swimming earlier than yesterday. Today's only an hour and a half session. First and foremost, which is so good. Could not with a three and a half hour orientation. Anyway, hopefully the bus is not crowded today. I swear to God, I was on the bus yesterday. There were people left, right and center. There were high school students. There was a screaming toddler. 
There's a truck. There was just everything that could go wrong in a bus trip. I was not having it. And the nerves, the nerves. But this time I'm like calm, chill, tis what tis. I forgot to film like literally everything, but basically I'm sweaty as fuck. Um, it was good. It was so much fun. Um, at one point, the guy there was like, you can get two dollar lunches. And I was like, and he was like, you can try that now. You know, you can come with us and get that two dollar lunch. And I was like, <laughs> funny story. So last night, I had $200 in my bank account. And then I went on to spend $200 on my hair. And was it worth it? Every fucking penny. It looks amazing. I love it. And I was like, so you know what that means. But then I lost my go card, so I had to overdraw my bank account anyway to be able to go on the bus. Anyway, it was chill. It was so much fun. I was like sitting there and he was like, we're all riders. And I was like, love that. He was like, you know, we all do creative stuff. I was like, okay, love this. Love this. Magic mic moment. I was like, what? But yeah, slaying, feeling it, living, living life. And now I just need to get ready for work. And I can't drive because I don't want to pay for parking. And I can't bus because go card. <laughs> Lost it somewhere. I don't know where, but if someone picks it up, Congrats, you got a free go card. I hope you're very happy about that. Um, anyway, let me get changed. And yeah, I love working. I love the money it makes. And then I love spending it to the point where I currently am in the negatives. So relatable. Oh my God, I'm so quick. You can't take me anywhere. Walking to work means you slip, slap, slop. This is the work fit. I know, so cute. I'm pretty sure I've worn it like 100 times before, but you know what? It's cute. I don't care. This has been a busy past few days. All I've done is get out of the house like both days. But that's more than most days. It's like pretty busy compared to my last year where I did absolutely nothing. There's now a lot of reading I need to do for uni. And I'm looking at it all now and I'm like, oh my God. But some of them is like week one, two and three. So it's like, oh, okay. And it's currently week zero. So therefore, like the procrastinator in me is just going, do later, do later, babes. Literally sees get degrees. I feel like I'm gonna start uni and then be like, no, I wanna do really good. But right now it's like, sees get degrees, you know what? I'm going in expecting to get some good tips, expecting a degree, and yeah, like, I care more about the lessons of uni than I do the grade that I get. Like, I know that employers find it really important. The fields that I want to go into, I know that you don't really need. Well, the fields I want to go into is rich and famous. And I know that you don't really need an employer for that. If you have the right sort of tips and tricks, if you can, you know, have fun with that. Creative writing, that's a bit of a side hustle, I guess. You know, means I can be creative. <laughs> Yeah, honestly, the orientation was made me go, you know what, this sounds sort of cute. This sounds sort of fun. I'm like, I'm down for this. I'm down in love. So excited. Maybe C's don't get the degrees for me. Maybe I'll be like sevens because they score it like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And like seven's the highest, you know, that sort of stuff. So I was like, Ugh, bleh. Oh, I feel like cars are judging me. Like this morning, I really didn't film anything because in the morning when I was getting on the bus, I was recording and someone looked over to me and I was like, oh, that's very embarrassing. Vlogging is really humiliating. No idea why I do it. Finishing this vlog off with a pizza. Now I know I've got less than zero dollars in my bank account, but my thinking was it's pizza and I'm already in the negatives. Once the wound is wounded, 
might as well just go day perfect a lot. It's my saying. So you can barely see me, but basically, thank you so much for watching this. If you enjoyed it, love you. I'm um, gonna eat my pizza. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Choked alone and bogged alone. Live life to the core. Oh, she flashed. Oh my God, is that a security camera? Yikes. Toodles. Thank you.